Guys, what is up? Josh here with PlanetChinchilla.com. Welcome back to the Planet Chinchilla YouTube channel. Thank you for coming back to the channel. The channel that is specifically designed for new chinchilla owners to learn how to take care and bond with their chinchillas in a better fashion and for people who just like watching videos of chinchillas. So if that's you, please be sure to subscribe to the channel. Give us a thumbs up on the video because when you do that, it helps us out a ton with the YouTube algorithm. And today, guys, I wanna cover my five favorite things about owning and raising a chinchilla. And we're starting right now. So today's video, guys, we do not have Asher out of the cage. She was already out earlier. It's middle of the day, so it's not really the time of the day we typically get Asher out of the cage, but hopefully she decides to make a bunch of appearances here on camera while we're making this video. But I wanna go ahead and dive into those five favorite things about owning a chinchilla. That way, if you're currently on the fence about it, it may convince you that it's time to go ahead and adopt one for yourself. So let's kick start it guys with number one is Asher here just keeps me company during the day. Working from home or even just doing things in general around the home, even if you don't work from home, it's nice having Asher or Chinchilla right next to my work desk all day. She does some crazy stuff. She gets up and interacts. She'll come to the front of the cage, to the cage bars, and it's just a cool pet in that aspect. And the thing that a lot of people don't understand is that while they're not as interactive as like a dog or even a cat, they are still interactive and do build a bond with their owner. So number one is nothing more than I simply like having her around. And I'm pretty confident you would feel the same if you owned one. They just do some crazy stuff from time to time. Which leads me directly into number two guys is it's a misconception on how little of interaction they will have with owners or the family. They are much more interactive than you think. On my previous video that I just did, Asher was out in the playpen with my son, with me, with my wife, climbing all around, doing crazy things. Chinchillas, if you take the time to bond with them and get them comfortable with the environment, they can be completely interactive, love their owners, enjoy being held, and build a really strong bond. So that's my second favorite thing about owning a chinchilla in general is just how interactive they can be with the owners. Guys, number three is I like how low maintenance a chinchilla can be. And it's not that you can just set them and forget them, but overall, outside of cleaning the cage, being careful with some diet and accessory type items with them, they are very low maintenance. Yes, you still need to get them out of the cage and try to interact with them and play with them whenever possible, daily or whenever it works for you, but besides that, if you have other things going on, they will forgive you. It doesn't have to be an everyday thing. And they are just a low cost, low maintenance kind of pet to own. So while that sounds like I'm just being cheap, it's still a major benefit of getting a loving, bonding, affectionate pet that recognizes you while having a relatively low maintenance schedule with them and low upkeep with low cost. So take that as you will, but it is one of my five favorite things of owning a chinchilla. Guys, number four is these chinchillas not only are interactive, like I said in number two, but they can be crazy and entertaining and fun. If you haven't seen a chinchilla taking a dust bath, you should go check that out. It's entertaining to watch. If you haven't had a, your chinchilla climb all over you yet or jump onto your head and just sit there and you recently adopted one, go give it a try. Get yourself a playpen so you can do that. If you haven't had like an interactive play area with a chinchilla yet, give that a try too. But they are crazier, have more of a personality and a spunk to them than most people give them credit for. And it is definitely one of my favorite things about owning one of them. Which leads me into number five, which is probably going to sound like it shouldn't be on my list because of what we know happened to my previous chinchilla that was younger than her time, so to speak. But... I love knowing that on average a chinchilla lives a long lifespan. Compared to other rodents, these guys live 10, 15 plus years, which is awesome. If you're gonna take the time to get them to bond with you, to get them out of the cage and to just go through all of kind of the initial growing pains, why wouldn't you want a pet that is around for that long? Obviously my experience with my previous chinchilla was not the case, but I know that that is not the law of averages. But again, the fact that they live as long as they do is one of my favorite things about owning a chinchilla. And I think it would be one of most people's favorite traits. Of All right guys, so what are your favorite traits
traits about owning a chinchilla or things about owning a chinchilla that you enjoy the most. Be sure to leave those comments for us down below. We love to read them. We love to respond to them. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and you find this kind of content useful or helpful. And again, guys, give us a thumbs up on the videos. They help us a ton. When you do that, it makes sure that YouTube knows that we make videos about chinchillas. So it'll let other people with chinchillas view those videos and hit the notification button for us so you're notified. Leave us some comments on what kind of videos you want to see in the future. And as a quick update guys, our new publishing schedule is going to Tuesdays and Sundays instead of Tuesdays and Thursdays. So you probably were expecting a video this past Thursday, so it'll come in this Sunday. Going forward it'll be Tuesday and Sunday. So be sure to carve out five minutes for those videos when they do come out. And never forget guys to head over to planetchinchilla.com. The web address will come across the bottom of the screen here in just a second, but just like those thumbs up help us on YouTube, whenever you type that into your URL web address bar on your computer, it helps us get seen over there as well by more chinchilla owners. So head over to the website, check out the blog. Never forget about checking out the ebook by going to the top menu and just clicking ebook downloads. Always feel free to use promo code chincare50, C H I N C A R E 50 at checkout for 50% off that ebook that is exclusive to people from the YouTube channel. Otherwise, guys, we will catch you on Tuesday morning. Thank you for coming back to the channel. Thank you for watching. Thank you to all the subscribers. See you soon and take care.